Yo, what's the latest call? Welcome back to the video. Today, I'm going to show you guys how you can add Roblox merch to your Roblox game that people can actually buy. So yeah, make sure you leave a like, subscribe, turn on that bell, notification, so don't miss out on any new videos. Let's get right into it. All right, so the first thing you want to do is search up mannequin. So mannequin, here it is. Search up the word mannequin. I'm just going to pick the first one because... I don't know, the first one is seems like a good one to pick from. So this is what you want to do to add the Roblox merch to your game. First thing you want to do, click down. Then I'm going to show you guys how to add the shirt. So the first thing to do is to add the shirt is to add the ID of the shirt. So what you want to do first is go get the merch that you're actually selling. So. I'm gonna use my personal Roblox shirt because I really, because I want to use it. So what you wanna do is copy this ID on the shirt. So once you click copy, go to the item ID, remove the zero and add it to the game. All right, so once you're done with this, you wanna go to your base plate, click down on this, go to shirt, double click it. Then you can see it'll appear down here or over here. Just remove it like this and add the ID in instead. Click enter and there you go. As you can see, it appears on the person and you can actually try to buy. So if I click play on the game and I walk over to the mannequin, you'll see that if I click the shirt, it will say, well, it would say, would you like to buy this? But because it's already in my inventory, I cannot buy it currently. So that is how you add the shirt to your game. Now I'm gonna do the same thing very quickly for the pants just because the pants are as easy as this. So of course, bring this up, go to pants purchase, go to the script. We're gonna go ahead and buy this one, the Nelk Boys X Champion Black Joggers. So what you wanna do is that you can actually put this in your game. You're just gonna copy the link, go to the thing, remove it, add in your ID, then go up, go to down, then go up, go down on this little guy, click pants, Go to the pants template, remove everything, add the ID, enter, and it there it is. Now, I don't actually own these pants, so it should be able to be buyable whenever I click it. So if I turn around over here and I click on the pants, as you can see, it will ask me to buy it. So there you go, that's how you add buyable merch to your Roblox game. You can actually do this with all the mannequins, even though they have different mechanics each. Even though they have all different mechanics each, it's very, very simple to add the merch to your Roblox game. So there you go, once again, that's how you add the merch to your Roblox game. Please leave a like, subscribe, to that bell notification without any new video. And of course, I don't usually make tutorials like this. I usually just make normal Roblox videos. So, go check out my channel. I might be streaming right now. I don't know, but thank you guys so much for watching again. And I'll see you guys on the next time. Bye!